I saw a young man was talking one time and was attacking Pastor Chris. And I started laughing. I said, Hello, you attacking who? Welcome back to my YouTube Pastor channel. Chris, you are Now, this is a very powerful... You are attacking. Um, let me explain something to you. Apostle Professor I told Shima. them him, I said, let, I said, sit down. Let me, when I finish with you, you understand. I said, Pastor Chris is not in this generation. Of God. Yes, you can't take No, I will explain to you. He He's in the world. Now he said he was in the meeting. Hold on. And he they just finished someone trying to a pastor's classroom um, conference. Pastor Chris Oyakilome. And, and Reverend Tom told me to, personally to give him, uh, that as uh, uh, when they were preparing for the and conference, 103 and million pastors have registered. You know, most times people speak oh, you, are, you think they are on YouTube and Facebook? They don't use those things. They have their own app. They have no idea of. No. Anything you see on those things is just extension. They have their own app. They are in the world of their own. 103 million young man was talking one time and was attacking Pastor Chris. And I started laughing. I said, you are attacking who? Pastor Chris, you are killing me. You are attacking. Let me explain something to you. I told them, I said, let, I said sit down. Let me, when I finish with you, you understand. I said, Pastor Chris is not in this generation. No, I will explain to you. He's in the world. Hold on. They just finished a pastor's classroom conference. And Reverend Tom told me personally that as at when they were preparing for the conference, 103 million pastors have registered. Oh, you, are, you think they're on YouTube and Facebook? They don't use those things. They have their own app. Anything you see on those things is just an uh, extension. They have their own app. They are in the world of their own. 103 million ministers. Why do you think they don't go around doing crusades? No venue to use. No ven they don't have any venue on earth they can use, so they stay on one spot. Because to get a venue, then the vendor can take like three million, four million. There's none like that. Then you went to one nation, you got that few thousands of people. You say you want to correct this man. 103 million pastors. Before the meeting ended, there were 110 million pastors that registered. I'm not saying 1.3, 100. You add Ghana and Togo. I'm the Republic. <laughs> that kind of man is who you want to correct. You see, are you trying to say that um, God cannot use um, little things to correct? God knows who he sends little things to, to go and correct. He knows who he's sending. Then I will not stand with, around such a man like Pastor Chris. I will not say he's my friend. Friend Bawo. Friend how? He can't be friend here. Yeah. When you want to grow, stop equating yourself with those who have grown. Friend how? That's a fit marshal. A class of his own. If you are in this ministry, you know one thing. I honor men of God. If you want to grow, stop. Stop. You see, you see a young man. He's calling names of gospel artists. He say, you know, me, my people like me, Sinaj, Omeme. You don't grow like that. Are you following what I'm talking about? Let me tell you this. I've, I've said this before. One time, I was, people were attacking Pastor Chris. They were speaking against Pastor Chris so much. And I called some brethren close to me. I said, is this the gospel? Gospel is good news. They said, oh, why will you do this? Why will you do that? Blah, 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 blah. All kinds of things. Attack team, attack team. I was very uncomfortable. There is no way you can have the Holy Spirit and you'll be free to attack people. Listen to this. People that have no relationship with God are the one that bothers about other people's relationship with God. Those who have relationship with God are conscious not to offend him. So they don't even not care about your relationship. But those who have no relationship with God are always, they are the referee of people's life. 
So they were speaking against Pastor Chris. And I was so angry. In fact, I cut off from some of my friend, pastor friends. I was so angry with them. I said, why are you doing this? And they said all kinds of things. So I was going to preach for full gospel businessmen fellowship in Abia State in Abba. So I was in the hotel and um, what do you call this? Atmosphere for Miracles. That's what they call this program. It came on air. And he was just worshiping. I felt the presence of God in that hotel. And I began to worship God along with him. Then the miracles began to happen. But I was just interested in the worship. God was moving there. And I just kept saying, Lord, thank you for your servant. Thank you. Look at blessing lives. <laughs> blessing lives. Oh, thank you. People were healed. I was just hallelujah. I was excited seeing joy that people were healed. I had a, a service in the next couple of hours. So when they finished, I just kept worshiping God, thanking God for those that were healed, thanking God for such a man of God who God had used and the rest. When I finished, under the atmosphere, over an hour of worship, at the intercom rings. They said, some people are here to pick you for the program. So I said, give me some minutes. I rushed, I showered because I was sweating. Showered, got my clothes on, and I came downstairs. As I entered the venue, now I'm not exaggerating, the hall should be about 400 people. As I walked into the venue and got to the pulpit and lifted up my hands, only two people were on their feet. Down, under the power. I've seen miracles, but I've never seen a sickness fall. That was the first time I saw somebody. Like flesh, cancer, what cancer? It fell. Hold on. Between me, who honored that grace, and they that were insulting, who gained? Who gained? All your prophecies are against men of God and the successful ones. How can pastor? How can pastor? How can a man of God buy a new car? He should give the money to the poor. The phone you are using to type that thing. Why not you sell it and give the poor? Since you are the advocate of poor masses. The phone, start with your own. That's what you can afford. The car is what he can afford. Start with your own. They, are, they don't care about the poor. Yeah, welcome back. I know um, this message has blessed you. It has um, helped your spirit. Yes. So please do not forget to like, share, and drop your comments on the comments box. And also, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Yeah, for more updates. God bless you.